What's going on guys, it's J-Ho back with more Destiny 2 and today we're gonna go over how to get the Fell Winter's Lie in 2021. So the wait is finally over and anyone can now get the Fell Winter's Lie shotgun and this is still the best shotgun for Crucible. So if you missed out on this weapon the first time around and you've been dying to this gun in the Crucible over and over and you've been mad or sad that Bungie hasn't brought it back yet, they finally did. Now you can finally get it really easily so all you need to do is head to the tower and go to the exotic archive monument to lost lights this is near the vault and then once you head in here click on legacy gear and it will be at the very top of the list so here it is all you need to purchase this is some glimmer some legendary shards two enhancement prisms and one ascendant shard so uh, not too pricey not too expensive uh, definitely worth it for the shotgun still the best shotgun in the game right now and the only downside to this is that i do believe it will be getting sunset at the end of season 13 which is the current season so you pretty much only have one season left to use this in the end game pvp content so trials and iron banner and then after that it's going to get sunset and we're going to need to use another shotgun instead for the end game stuff but at least you can use it for one more season if you haven't had it already but here is how you get Fell Winter's Lie. There's also some other new stuff that was added to this kiosk as well. If you click on the first section for Red War Exotics, they added the Outbreak and Whisper Exotics that were previously not in here. So these two exotics were from Special Missions. And these two are pretty decent exotics. Not as good as they used to be in previous metas, but still pretty good to have. So you can now acquire those two if you're missing those two from your collection as well. And then also I think they added these three as well. So we got the Wither Horde, the Ruinous Effigy, and the Traveler's Chosen. These three were from Season 11. And then the other one that they added is the one from last season, the Season Pass Weapon Duality. So those were newly added as well. But the main focus is, of course, the Fell Winter's Lie. So go pick it up if you haven't already and then go use it in the Crucible. You have one more season to utilize it in endgame stuff. But that's about it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. As always, stay tuned for more videos and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace!